What's going on YouTube? It's Stanley coming at you here on a Sunday afternoon. I got a card show recap from yesterday. Uh, went to a show at the Holiday Inn a couple miles from my apartment. Uh, smallest card show size-wise, at least room size-wise, I've ever been to. Just And there were lots of people there. It was really crowded. Um, like I told a few people, I said, I think I legally married ten people. For ten dudes, uh, while I was there, with how tight knit it was in there. Um, anyway, got a few cards to show off. Nothing huge, uh, but some nice stuff. Uh, first of all, I went to um, one of the vintage guys' table, and he had a bunch of old packs, loose packs, and I bought uh, two packs of '81 Fleer, two, three packs of '81 Donruss. Uh, they had them. He had them for two bucks each, so I bought ten bucks worth. Uh, just show off the highlights here. Got Earl Weaver, Carlton Fisk, Johnny Bench, Jack Morse, Fernando Valenzuela, Steve Carlton, Pete Rose. And Bert Blylevin. Next off, I was at another table. I was going through a guy's prices mark box. Um, all the cards are 25 cents or 50 cents. Um, and I saw these cards this Star Day 2001. There wasn't anybody really big um, on the cards, but I liked the way they looked, so I grabbed all that he had. And uh, turns out it was a 15 card set, and he had all 15 cards, so I actually have the entire set. Uh, got Travis Lee. Uh, remember he was a, n the number one pick for the Twins once, and then signed, so he ended up with the Diamondbacks. Uh, Jose Cruz Jr. Uh, Paul Canerco, back when he was a Dodger. Bobby Estalela, Phillies. Maglio Donez. Juan Encarnacion, Richard Hidalgo, Abraham Nunez, Sean Casey, the mayor, uh, Todd Helton, Brad Fulmer, Ben Grieve, Levon Hernandez. Jarrett sure, Wright. This is 98 Fleer EX. Uh, started 2001. In case I didn't say or you didn't see. And Todd Dunwoody. Um, next for the Twins cards I picked up. I didn't pick up a ton of Twins cards. Um, I ended up with 23 more that I needed. Um, so I made it to 8,600 even different Twins cards. Picked up a few uh, vintage. First got Frank Willsey, uh Played second base and was a future manager of the Twins. 69 tops. Earl Batty, 66. And then uh, 76 tops batting leaders of uh, Rod Crew, Fred Lynn, and Thurman Munson. It was a really cool card for a buck. Couldn't pass that up. Uh, the one hit I picked up was a 2018 Donruss. Uh, Promising Pros Materials. Alberto Mejia, I believe is starting the year in the minors with all the pitchers that they signed this offseason. Nice jumbo jersey there with a pinstripe. And I only picked up one other card. Um, well, I, I mean, I didn't only pick up one other card. I picked up uh, some random Oakland A's and some random Vikings as well. But nothing, you know, worth showing in this video anyway. Uh, last card I picked up. Uh, one of the sellers, he always has a bunch of wrestling autographs. The guy's not a wrestling fan yet, he has wrestling autographs, I don't get it. Um, and this one for cheap, I decided to pick it up, I was always a fan of theirs, uh, of this tag team that he was the leader of, so I had to pick up an autograph for his. Michael P.S. Hayes, it's number 32 out of 50, Legends autograph. 
I sent this picture to to uh, Den Denny Den Ten Thirteen. He goes, "It's Dog the Bounty Hunter." Dog the Bounty Hunter wishes he was as cool as this guy was. Uh, so yeah, um, leader of the fabulous Freebirds, Bad Street USA, baddest house on the block, last house on the left, or something like that. I think it was. Um, fans of the mid '90s WWF may remember him as Doc Hendricks. I think the video is gone. I wasn't able to find it the last time I wanted to watch it, but there's a video called Doc Hendricks Meets Crystal Meth, and it's from an In Your House pay-per-view where they go to him backstage for an update, and he just starts talking 90 miles a minute, and he can't understand anything he says. Just talks just nuts. Uh, but yeah, that's it for today, guys. Um, don't think I got anything coming in. Oh, I might have a card next week at some point. But that is it. And, uh, next show is a couple weeks from now. Yeah, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys next time I got a video to make. Later.